Hello friends, in this video lab, I will show you the steps to create a map drive using item level targeting group policy object. Item level targeting is a feature in a group policy through which we can target a group policy to be deployed on a particular set of users. In map drive using item level targeting group policy, a group policy object would be linked to an OU but the policy would only be deployed to a set of users that are the member of a particular group and not to all the users that are in the OU. In this video, I have already created one OU named sales theme and under sales theme we have a two user named sales1 and sales2. Now let's create a one group named sales users. Now click on OK and here we have a group named sales users. Now let's add our user sales1 to our group sales users. Okay and that's it. Now our user sales1 is a part of our group sales users but the sales2 is not a part of our group sales users. Now for this demonstration we have a two user named sales1 and sales2 but we only want to deploy the group policy on our user sales1 and not to all the users that are the part of our OU. Now first of all we need to create a one share folder so on a server manager click on file and storage services click on share and let's create a new share. Select SMB share quick, click on next and select type custom path, click on browse. On a T drive already I created one folder named share1, select the folder and click on next. Now this is the other path for our share and that is UNC path lab this is 01 slash share1. Click on next, click on next and as you can see our share level permission is everyone have a full control. Now we are not going to customize the permission for this demonstration. Click on next and click on create to create the share folder. You can close to close the console. Now here we have a one folder name share one. And the next step is we need to create a one group policy object. To do that just open group policy management console. Once you open a group policy management console, on a console expand your domain and select your OU. In our case our OU is a sales theme. Now just right click on it and select create a GPU in this domain and link it here. Now let's specify the name of our group policy object. Now just specify the name map drive with item level targeting. Click on OK. Now right click on newly created group policy object and select edit to edit the settings. This will open a group policy management editor and under user configuration expand preferences, expand window settings and click on drive maps. Now on our drive maps, just right click on it and select new and select map drive. Now we are going to create a new map drive that's why under action we have to select create. Now this time we have to specify the path, you know case the path will be lab this is row 1 slash the name of our share folder and that is the share 1. If you want to reconnect then select reconnect. Now let's specify the label, it is data and the drive letter will be I select use first available starting from drive letter edge. Okay, now let's click on apply and this time we have to click on common. Now here we have to select item level targeting, click on targeting and this will open a, another console for targeting editor. Now click on new item on a target editor console and select security group to add that security group which we have created in an active directory users and computers console. Item level targeting can also be deployed for other options like users, site, operating system, domains and etc. Now we have to select the group. So let's specify the group name. In our case the group name is sales users. Click on check name and click on OK. So this is the group from our domain name MPRTV. So the user is a member of security group name MPRTV slash sales user. You can also create a multiple other combinations by clicking on new item and from here you can also specify the another criteria if you want to use. But for this demonstration we just want to use the criteria for security group. Click on OK, click on apply, click on OK. And as you can see now we have a drive letter edge. This will create a map drive. The path will be this. Now at any point of time if you want to modify this 
you can just right click on it and select property now go for the command click on targeting and from here you can modify these settings click on ok click on apply and click on ok now it's time to test these uh, group policy settings and for this demonstration purpose we have a one windows 10 computer and on windows 10 computer let's log in with our user name sales1 so once you log into windows 10 computer let's uh, open command prompt and type command gp update slash force to update the group policy remember you have to log in with the user who is a member of our security group that we added in a targeting editor console to verify that our policy of mapping a drive using item level targeting is deployed or not and in our case our user sales1 is a member of our group named sales users now let's open a file explorer and as you can see right now oh, we did not have a uh, any map drive now let's click on close and let's click on close now i'm going to sign out from this windows 10 system now let's again log in with our user sales1 okay once you log into windows 10 computer with our user sales1 now let's open file explorer and under this pc you can see we have a map drive name data so as you can see our user sales1 has map drive name data now also want to verify with our user name sales2 so for this demonstration again i'm going to sign out from this user and we'll log in with our user name sales2 okay let's log in with our another user sales2 let's open file explorer and under this piece you can see there is no map drive due to item level targeting so in this way we can use item level targeting with group policy preference i hope this videos will helpful for you guys thanks for watching this video